Hi, welcome once again to another video tutorial. This round I will be introducing to you how to use the software called Epic Worship. It is a free software developed by the developer by the name of Philip Ecke, the CTO of Qtune Interactive. The software is fully open source and you can download from www.qviso.com look under Epic Worship, you can download the Mac or the Windows version now let's dive in into the software itself Epic Worship is a free software which allows you to have uh, elegant controls of your projection during a worship service okay, uh, when you start the software it will usually ask you where do you want to project the worship to so usually you will have a laptop like mine that has a video display port and usually you will have a spanning uh, windows enable which is you press the start button and set it to extend and what happens is that you will have part of your uh, desktop which is showing on this computer screen the other half is for projection purposes but for this tutorial I'm gonna uh, show you uh, the user interface on top of the actual projection screen so you can actually see what's happening on the computer here in this video I'm gonna set the worship projection to display zero now this is the interface of the big worship as you can drag you can see the projection is actually running at the background so usually that GUI of Epic which it goes to the other screen so you just drag it or uh, you keep this screen here and the projection goes to display zero which is the other screen get it? yeah okay let's run through the, the simple user interface of Epic Worship you will have the creation and scheduling system and the live tab okay live is where you do all the projection but let's go to creation you will usually create a service presentation based on say service of 10 a.m. service 21st 21st of July oops July 2013 that's a 10 minute service and that service you can put in songs they are already selected by the worship leader so you select the songs by default uh, you can enter a song by just creating a plus here and you can create a new song by typing in the lyrics uh, easy epic worship is quite straightforward because if you have a blank it knows it is a uh, it is a flipping of another page basically this is it's automatically interpreted, in, interpreted as uh, flip the page to the next few lines and the flip page. So let's do it this way. Let's add this song, and maybe the next song is uh, "Can Never Sing." And then after that, we can have a video. We go to the media section. I have already downloaded the video, which is a HD video of a uh, yeah some computer project. The AR glass. Okay, let's add it to our and then let's go back to the song. We can add a scripture. Let's choose Genesis. Uh, John, I really like John, so let's go to John 1 1 to 1 1 to 1 2. Okay, add to presentation. Is it there? There, yeah, it's added now. Okay, so let's go to uh, the actual power projection. Maybe we put another song here. My God is a miracle God. Okay, so our service is done. Very very short service, but okay. Let's go to live. The live tab is where you do all your projection control. Where you control. So let's let's drag this down and see what happens if you click that. Wow, awesome God. Let's just drop this down really small. So I go through the next page. We give you page. So it has three pages, and as you click the empty line, the screen will blank up. Okay, so you keep going on. 
the next song and you know listen to the song as the people sing you just follow and then we come to uh, maybe a video announcement this, uh, that's the video just imagine that screen the screen will be just on the other half of the screen it goes directly to project so whatever you do whatever you do here you know you even you are uh, sending out um, MSM messages to people in the service like uh, do this, you know, do that. And you're getting ready a PowerPoint, nobody will know. So it's pretty good. Okay, let's stop the video. This is a very, very HD video. Let's go back to the, the, go to the screen. The video will stop. Now, the background here can be changed too. You can change it while singing on the line. Go to backgrounds. You can turn off other turn off the motion background and you can see that it becomes a static picture you can even change the static picture change the picture background let's load other static load a new background see or the next maybe after the first song you might want to have a motion background so you just go to motion turn it on and then you can go to the next song can you, you can even see that the the video and everything fits in. It's very elegant. There's no drastic change in opening. There's no opening of PowerPoint, flipping of this and that, and it's really disturbing sometimes. Can even change the motion background. So we load, and there's a library of free motion background available. You can even create your own, or you can buy from um, some stock video uh, websites, and you can pay. For for our uh, loop of videos for backgrounds. Say for example, let's try bright. Look at that. It's very amazing. Or you can have another one. You can have motion dots. So it goes straight away, it changes. Isn't that amazing? You can play video HD videos too. So it's all depending on what code that you have installed. And you can go to scripture. In the beginning was the word, the word was God, the word was with God. Yeah, so you know the pastor somebody will be doing so there there will be all this flexibility. And sometimes you know the song leader will decide to just sing one stand so you can just do a clear screen, everything is gone. Isn't that amazing? You can import PowerPoint. So you can run PowerPoint from this um, from within this um, schedule PowerPoint. Yeah, I'll do that in the next video. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the song. To download the software, look at the link below. Below this YouTube video. Thank you.